So routinely we perform ex uh, research and uh, we are a group of uh, professors here who have projects and we keep on working on it. And uh, to say, to highlight the, uh, the research outputs that we have got, uh, uh, there are two Ministry of Earth Science projects that have been sanctioned for Sai University right. and we have uh, two research scholars, Ministry of Earth Sciences, Ministry of Earth Science right. projects. So we have two research scholars recruited for it and they oh. are working here with their projects. Yeah, great, yeah. Great, yeah. What is yeah. the ratio of uh, male to female ratio in uh, health sciences ma'am? Generally you know so. it's a... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I think you understood my question. Yes, so we try to have a balance and it's of course it's the interest of students to come and, uh. and of course there is the job opportunities uh, particularly after COVID. The job market for allied health students have uh, drastically shooten up. Mm. So, if you have the interest, uh -huh. you can surely join. Uh, what is the male to female ratio? Will uh, need it if needed. <laughs> sir, I'm not what sure. <laughs> I'm not sure. That's the reason I'm pushing around. Uh -huh. I'm not sure, sir. Uh, in I'm general, not, sure. not one is to one. Not one is to one. Uh -huh. mm, girls are more. More. But, uh, more. Yeah. but even uh, girls are more now, yeah. but even boys can uh, I, join. I'll it. tell that. I'll uh, tell yeah, that. Yeah. So, so uh, apart I'll from ask the question, man. Uh, generally, uh, there will be many of the uh, you know, female students that you pursue yeah, in yeah. health sciences or yes. science groups. Yes. And what is the uh, current yeah. ratio here and what do you expect to so, say to the male so, and female students? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, successfully we have been running BSc Biological Sciences program and BTEC Biotech program at Sai University al along with the allied health programs. So, there we can see a little bit of higher amount of girls taking. It's not exactly one is to one ratio. Uh, but Particularly after COVID, I can see uh, there is a lot of interest in uh, boys uh, to take up this profession also. Mm -hmm. So we are hoping that we'll have a very balanced ratio in upcoming days. Yeah. Uh, thank you so much for joining uh, with thank us, you. Uh, Dr. Manobala. Thank you, sir. Thank uh, you. See, Allied Health Sciences Group on 820, but prefer chess, but can COVID travate intente, Abbail choose chess code and the code Pirutu was found. So, Allied Health Sciences Group on 820, it's not confined to only female but also male so kabatti different uh, subjects tonight i think there are 13 groups uh, uh, different specializations yeah, that can 13 be done different specialization that is being offered by sai university in collaboration with uh, apollo health sciences anamata you can have uh, the list of all those courses anamata meek edaithe interest untundo aa course lo irrespective whether you are a girl or a boy or you are male or female you can join <laughs> the group anamata this is the world class lab facilities at sai university with Manobalagaru.